everyone welcome to the simple devops channel in this video we are going to learn how to host a static website in amazon s3 simple storage service so let's go to the aws console and let's click on services and here we can come to the storage at the end you can see let's click on storage and here you can see the scalable storage in the cloud s3 let's click on this and first thing first we need to create a bucket as you can see so let's give it create a bucket and let's name it let's say simple devops website all right so then we have to for object ownership we need to enable access control list enable it let's click on this enable it and here we need to for object ownership we need to select object writer not bucket owner preference so let's click on object writer and then move on for public for block public access settings for this bucket we need to uncheck this box and then we have to click on i acknowledge all right then you can leave all the default configuration and create click on create bucket and this will create as a bucket as you can see simple devops website and now we need to click on this bucket and then we need to upload some objects all right so if you have a website so you have to upload it let's click on this upload and add files and here on my documents i have a simple index html let me upload it here as you can see so let's click on upload and once we upload the object as you can see index.html we need to close here and then we need to go to the buckets let's click on this simple devops website and here we need to click on properties and then at the end if you see there is a static website hosting so we need to click on the right edit click on edit and here we need to enable static website hosting otherwise it will not work so let's click on enable and here, as you can see, here there is an index document. So we need to write index.html. And hosting time should be host a static website. And index.html. So we are done. So let's click on save changes. And after that, if you come to the end, end of this page, you can see there is a website bucket website endpoint. You can see the URL. Let's click on, let's copy this URL and in a new tab, I'm going to paste it here. As you can see, it's showing me 403 forbidden. Why? Um, you, can, you can just pause the video and then try to solve the problem. And now we are going to solve this error. So let's go to Amazon S3 and here we need to go to objects all right so let's check these objects we have index.html here you can select all the objects if you have more than one object so here you have to click on actions and here we need to make public you make a public using access control list let's click on this and here we need to click on make public and now it will work if you go to the new tab and refresh the page as you can see welcome to simple DevOps channel, simplify your cloud and DevOps journey, simple DevOps. So this is how you can host a static website. So this is a simple index.html. So you can basically host your website if you have. So that's all about it for this video. Make sure you go to the buckets and then delete your buckets because it will charge you if you leave it as it is. So in order to delete buckets, first you need to and the first you need to delete your objects so let me delete my object here want to permanently delete it i'm going to copy here and paste after i delete my objects i can go to my buckets and here let me click on buckets and let's select this and click on delete and i have to write my bucket name in this case simple devops website and delete bucket so this is how you can host a static website in amazon s3 thank you very much and please don't forget to like the this video and then i will see you in the next lecture
Thank you.